to show what my dad's been doing in the garage for the better part of like the last six to eight months and that's building a plane um not like a full-on plane not like a rc plane um and i have this to thank for why i have access to like power some power tools like that those two that guy right there and all those other tools um he's building a air bike ultra light um there you go that guy right there um Thank you. And here is, here, he's doing the wings right now. This right here is an aileron. Let's focus up. He, he just finished covering with whatever. Um, and it's pretty cool. So it's wood frame. This one right over there, I can show you. He's doing some stitching. Uh, I helped a little bit. I, I've helped a little bit with this stuff. Not like particularly much. Like I've probably done like less than 1% of um, the stuff that's been done here, um, but look at all those blueprints. This is the wing. I think the first thing he did was he made like 20 of these guys right here, um, the wing bits. Here's, here's another aileron, so he, it's the same thing as this guy, but he's, co he's covered it over there. Um, you know, this will move some control system, and you know, that control I blew, uh, up and down. Um, sorry, let's use some better terminology. I believe that would be pitch. That controls pitch. Um, here's the wings again. Big wings. It's been a, it's been a lot of work. He's, been, he's worked a lot on this. And again, I, I've helped a little bit. A little bit. Not, again, I can't say I did much, but I did rivet in for uh, another one of the control surfaces. Help out here. I, I, I do some helping out, but I get he does pretty much all of this, and it's, it's, it's a really cool thing that he's doing. It's real cool to watch this being built. Um, and it's cool because once it's being, once it's done, you know, I'll, I'll, even I'll be able to fly it. You don't need a pilot's license to um, fly this. It's in the like one of three rule for air, ultralights worth it. If it's under certain parameters, like there's a fuel limit, like I think this the fuel c capacity right here, this, uh, there's no gas in here, but this is, um, I don't know, I think there's like five gallons of gas. This is the max, you can hold five gallons, you can go like under, I don't know, 40 miles per hour or something, a certain weight, only hold one person, you don't need a license, you don't really need anything to fly it, so I, I could be able to fly it. Um, I wanted to, and I probably will. Uh, and that's really, really cool. Uh, we have hangar space. It's really lucky there, too. Um, but North Carolina, oh my god, all the hangars are, one, they're super expensive. Two, they're all filled up, and there's a long wait list. But my dad was driving through. He saw a small airport, right? And he goes up, and he's like, oh. And he asks the guy, hey, can I fly here? And the guy's like, yeah, sure. And he's like, can I have, can I buy hangar space here? And the guy's like, oh no, there's, but, but then he says that there is a guy down the road who does have hangar space, so it's really awesome, really cool. We do have hangar, we have like, <laughs> one of the few open hangars here. Um, <laughs> and like, within like a 50 mile radius, probably more, it's crazy. But this is cool, still a long ways to go. Um, I don't have the, the big book he uses uh, for this stuff. Um, but there's gonna be a frame. You can Google uh, Ultralight Air Bike 103, um, or I think that it'll be in the thumbnail too. You can look at that. But it's gonna have that, you have that, it has to have the frame shift to him. It's gonna be, I think, three parts. And we'll have to figure a way to get that together. And there's a lot more, there's a lot more to it. Um, so I can't say it's close to done. But it's a lot, of, a lot of progress is being made, and that's that's really cool. Um, I think under this board right here. Let's see if I can. Oh shoot! Is it this board? It might be. Ooh. Okay, I'm not gonna do that because that's gonna make a mess. Whoopsie. But that's the jig he had used to make each of those parts, and that that was a lot of work. I can't remember. That's not good. Um, if I made one, I might have. 
made one of those guys for um okay. Whoopsie, that was close. Um Let's look at some other stuff. Yeah, he's been riveting. That's what I've done that for him. Um Yeah, so this is some metal part. I don't know where he has it. And he's also kind of he's made a seat for it too already. But there is some metal part. That's like a little control surface. I forgot what exactly it does. I think it keeps the throttle steady or something. Um, but it's gonna be controlled. This thing right here. But, and I, I did most of the work on that little piece. Um, and he, he, but yeah, I can't say I did a lot. Um, but yeah, it's real cool. Um, some other parts to it. Try to find some. A lot of wood. Gets a lot of shipments of wood. Uh, this stuff's cool. So it's like a big roll of this stuff. I don't know where it is, but it's a big roll of this stuff and you have to wrap it around here and then you take a heat gun and you, uh, at, you first you get like a lower heat setting and it activates the glue and you hold it on. Then you higher heat setting and it shrinks it down and uh, that's how that works. Oh, here, here might be the book. No, this is the, uh, this is the, the stuff, the, um, I mean, look at look at all this. And that's just that is just for this part. The the um the wrapping. It's a lot. There's there should be some metal tubes around here, and that's gonna be the wing struts. But I can't find them. In case some smaller metal tubes. I don't know if this is, this stuff is extra or not. Um, it's spare. But it might be. Oh, and then these parts right here. Um, he made himself. Like, so he took strips of this and used uh, this grinder and a titanium drill bit to make this. And I'll show you where that is. That is, um, those are these guys. I don't know why I made so many. I'm not too sure. But, yeah. Um, so, I don't know. Look at all that wood. But that's, that's all there is, really. Actually, that's a fairly long video. So, uh, yeah, later.